Hello and welcome back to the Forgotten City. Today, hmm, I have no idea what we'll be doing today. Is it going down here? Yeah, I've been over there. Um, let's try talking to this. Will you hit this down? There is nothing in this house. That's quite an impressive bow you have there. Just like Diana's. Thank you. A new face. I'll bet. Um. Mm. See you again soon. Nope. Yes, I know. There was nothing up here, if I remember correctly. But this brings me here. You. Can we talk now? Yes, we can. Great. Mario. Uh. Whatever. Just remember. Where is he? Thank you. I am delighted and deeply honored to have been elected your met. I thought we'd find him Demetrius here. doesn't usually let anyone in here. Hmm. I try. Don't you have any bodies buried in here? I have to admit, I'm quite lost. She's still crying. But I'm gonna unlock her doors for her. Just so she can get out anytime she wants. But I'm really lost right now. This doesn't really give me anything. She's beneath this roof. There's no way we can see what's inside there. Inside of her room. Come on. Leif, you can do this. Nope. She couldn't. <laughs> okay, let's talk to... Keep an eye out for Santella, would you? Yeah, well, these doors are really useless. <laughs> oh, I have to admit. Oh, another one fresh out of the baths, I take it. <laughs> Can we talk about Scintilla? Oh, you heard about her disappearance, I take it. I found this pendant in the cistern. Any idea whose it was? Oh no, that's Scintilla's. I forgot about it. The question is, what was it doing in the cistern? I found it on the neck of a skeleton. A skeleton? Oh, God. You mean she's... She's... I don't know. Something about it doesn't seem right to me. What do you mean? I'm just not sure how she could have been reduced to a skeleton after only three weeks. But didn't Domitia say there's some kind of creature down there that killed and ate Hannibal? Could it not have attacked her too? He did, which makes me wonder, what if this, that skeleton was Hannibal's? What are you saying? That somebody crept down there and put Centilla's amulet on another body to make us think she was dead? Why would anyone do such a thing? Perhaps they abducted her and was want us to stop looking for her. But 
who? Who could have a reason to do that? Um. Malios, you'd do anything to hurt your father. That is an extremely serious accusation. I take it you have something to back it up. I'm still investigating. So this is just baseless speculation then. I've heard enough. I won't have you peddling scurrilous gossip about my sister's tragic death. Kindly keep your insane cons Ah damn it. Yeah, she has no windows whatsoever. So we screw that up. I will try to talk about each thing with her. Yeah, I remember there not being any windows. If I say it was it's Dali, then I assume you Yeah, I don't care who you are. I And no, it's it's not there. Oh my goodness! It's Ulpius. It's Amitius. Why do you say that? He's been trying to imitate people into voting for Maliolus. Mm, so I'm told. This is truly atrocious behavior, which undermines the very foundations of our democracy. Thank you for bringing this to my attention, but before we proceed, I must ask, are you sure he's the one? It's him. Well then, in that case, as much as it pains me to do so, I must act decisively to ensure the survival of my people. As magistrate, okay. I hereby... Uh, Alright, I will take his outfit again. More with Sentia. On your best behavior, I trust. And can we talk to Galerius? Isn't the great temple majestic? Mm. Welcome. Feeling all right? Yep. Uh, okay. That's Maybe we can talk with Julia. Where is she? You are over here, then where can we find you, Leo? Oh, Whatever's in that great temple up there on the bluff. Oh, hello there, friend! I died from the Shrine of Diana, only to discover you'd locked me up beside with angry hornets. I managed to escape, and after a horrible ordeal in the palace and traveling back in time, here I am. Uh, are you well, stranger? Have you been out in the sun too long? You seem a little... confused? Perhaps you should go and see Lucretia in a clinic. <sighs> no, Very well. Wait. Another time. Where's Yulia? Oh, something's happening. Why can't I ask you about Yulia's robot? For the last time, Daisis, I'm not making you a bow. Greetings and salutations. You know why. Uh, oh. Ah, I knew this day would come. Let's just get through with it. To you, my friend, but even discussing this matter is dangerous. Then, so Please, let us leave the live call safely beneath the ash. You can trust me, we foreigners have to stick together, remember? Very well, but the magistrate would not look kindly upon this, so please keep it to yourself. For several months now, I have been sneaking out at night to worship the gods of my ancestors in the temple of Demeter. Each day, I leave offerings of food in the hope that we may have a bountiful harvest, and yet the next day when I return, the food is missing. How strange. So I ask, who or what is devouring the food in this temple? 
stranger still. Once I sat in front of my shop like the hundred eyed Argus until dawn to see if I could spot a thief going in. But do you know what I saw? Someone who'd been drinking? Nothing. Nobody entered. And yet when I went to take a look, my offering was gone. It is bizarre, is it not? When I told my friend Kabash of this at the tavern, he offered to help investigate. He went in, and to my dismay, he was never seen again. Okay, I'm off to think of the matter here. Oh, sorry. As a kind of person to be deterred by such warnings, so just be careful. I beg you. I have no idea why those are those show up now, <laughs> after we are done with Kabash. Where is Yulia? <gasps> no, maybe, maybe she is on the field. Uh, well, at least I saw one person. Oh, it's not her. Hey, Galerius. Sorry again, friend. I went and did as you asked, and it worked. How is it possible that you've just arrived? Uh, you'd never believe me if I told you. Oh, come on. I just did as you asked. The least you can do is level with me. I'm reading this someday over and over again. Uh, you're toying with me, right? You're a Sisyphus. Yeah, that's the one. Oh. Um. Sisyphus was. Yep. He was forcing. Tans oh. Yes, we know. Go on. Anyway, I don't know which god you managed to upset to get yourself into this position. So I'll tell you what. I'll keep doing whatever I can to. Thanks, guys. Anytime, friend. Now I'm going to keep your secret. Oh, and if our conversations ever start to annoy you... No, I need to talk to you about something else. Ah. Salve again, my sister. Now. Mm hmm. All right, friend. Hmm. Where the hell is Yulia? Oh, you. You, you, you. Oh, yes. Shalom. What's your story? You mean where am I from and all that? Judea, originally. But when I was a child, I moved to Rome with my family. Romanized my name and spent most of my life in the Jewish district of Trans Tiberim, across the Tiber from the main city. That's where I was when the fires broke out. Everyone was running toward the river, and I, listening to my inner contrarian, ran the other way. Every road leading out of Rome was in chaos full of people with all their belongings in carts and brigands preying on them. Several hours down the Appian Way, I saw another Jewish family being attacked by three opportunists. So I picked up a branch from the side of the road and went to defend them. I can only assume they got the better of me because the next thing I knew, I was waking up in a forest by a river not far from here with no memory of how I got there. It's strange though because I still had my purse on me. Why would a robber knock me unconscious and throw me in a river, but not take my coins? Good on you for asking your wife to help others. A lot of good it did me. And that family. I sometimes wonder what happened to them. Do you know a way out of here? I don't. But even if I did, I'm not going anywhere. I have unfinished business. What do you think about the golden rule? Well, neither of us have a couple of hours to stand around talking about theology, law, and collective punishment, so I guess you're looking for a pithy summary? <laughs> More or less. You remind me of an old story from my people about Hillel the Elder. He was approached by a Gentile and asked to explain the entire Torah while he stood on one foot. Obliging, he replied, What is hateful to you, do not do to another. That is the whole Torah. The rest is commentary. Go and learn. Of course, what I want to know is, what kind of a god sees a young woman abducted and does nothing about it? Not my god, that's for sure. Good question. Thanks. 
I just wish there was a way to find out. Who are you going to vote for? Sentius, I suppose. I'd have to be insane to vote for Maliolus after what he did to me. Fair enough. Really? All right, friend. Thanks for the chat. I really hope. And why were you going that way? Hey, 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 why were you going that way? Peculiar. Yes, I know. Anubis slash Hades slash Pluto has nothing better to do but to watch puny people doing their little things, really. I really can get. What if I crouch? I can open it. Why won't you let me through? And why I can't move you like an. All your statues. The ones I can move, that is. Cerberus lifts his triple head and lets out his threefold praying. <laughs> Nivia, would you stop muttering like Medea over a cauldron? You'll scare away my customers. They follow their trades, imitating their previous lives, but they are ignorant. This again. You're in a world of your own, aren't you? Okay, now I can talk. Ah, oh, you're here. And, uh, there's... And you're as charming as you are beautiful. Ugh, coming on a bit strong, don't you think? What? You came on to me. I take back what I said. Let's just forget that. Me. Uh, uh, no. All right. Celia. Do you have something interesting to say? But no. Then how can we get into that other room? And where is Yulia? I'll be now running around looking for that one person <laughs> because she's not where she usually is. Nope. What about her? in Yulia. Can you tell me where Yulia is? Really, I need to talk with her about what Maliol is did to her. Feeling all right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, can, can we talk about sure. Yulia? What do you want to know? Did you hear her say anything about escaping? Uh, how did you know that? Yes, she did mutter something about the only way out. A few times. But nothing more than that, I'm afraid. Hmm. Gladly. That. No, we don't know where she is. Mm, really? Isn't Keep an eye out for Sentinel, would you? Majestic. Yes, chill. Yeah, see, though, where are they? Might be Yulia in here. Oh, maybe Claudia is done crying. In her eyes out. Nope, she's not. I'm not supposed to be in here. Okay. Where do you keep Demetrius, your voices? Come quickly! We're being robbed! This is outrageous! Hey. I'm really sure he didn't hear her.
Nope. Okay, I think I'll just take my sweet time and look for Yulia and Pius. Um, so, no, I can't even stop. Oh, I can pause the recording, so never mind. I might delete this. Yes, I can hear it, though I don't. Although, I don't know where you are. Hey. Maybe they both went to that. Wait. Maybe he wasn't going in, he was going out. Is Yulia Christian as well? If so, maybe she's in this. No, there's probably not, sure. not getting anything from you. Right. Where are you going? Yes, I am going to... <laughs> I'm gonna spy on him. Maybe he'll take me to where Yulia is. He's going to... Really? Okay, so he'll just... You, Sisyphus, attack or pursue the stone that always returns. Hmm? Oh, there's something over there. He went for all of that. No one over here. So I guess the only thing left to track is that cave. I really have no idea where I should look for anything. I can't find any more keys. Malios won't talk to me. Maybe we should bring the medicine ourselves. And wait for Yulia to wake up. Because we need to somehow... Oh, right. We're here. We're back here. Never mind. The 49 melodies fetch again. With incessant... Pretty work, And what's with that room? Okay, you know what? I'm gonna end this part here. I'm gonna look for Yulia some more. And I have no idea what will I do after that. It was not there. Uh, so for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye!